I've got a question about ball machines. Should I get a ball machine? Very personal question. And from my vantage point, and I'm gonna turn to CJ in a second here, I'll give you some ideas on what you're looking for. Two factors. One, are you gonna use a ball machine? If you get a ball machine, make sure you're gonna use it. Expensive proposition, make sure you get out there and use it. Second, if you're gonna use a ball machine, make sure you're drilling correctly. It's really important to drill correctly. As to which ball machine to get, in terms of brands, we've used different brands, Lobster, Tudor, Simon, they're all fine. They all work pretty well. In terms of features, CJ. So as far as feature you go, spin is probably the most asked one. Do you need to have spin? I don't think you need to have spin unless you're at altitude, then spin is helpful to keep the ball lower. Uh, another one that I do think is important is oscillation so that the ball moves around. There's a few others like uh, two line of sight, on off switch, uh, nice features. Do you have to have them? I think you do a price comparison and decide if that's something that you have to have. All right, hope that helps. Make your decision on getting a ball machine. Stay well out there.